Hello, uh, this is a uh, vlog, I guess, on sort of just research uh, topics that I've come across, uh, you know, in my personal projects. And so uh, I'm making these because I really feel that every, all knowledge should be free. And that's kind of how the world I want to live in. And I want to help people learn CG and help them uh, gain skills and live an awesome life doing something that they love. So uh, on this one, uh, it is uh, like this carving text effect or drawing text effect right here. So this is what I'm doing here. So it's very simple, you know, it's just to carve on some text really. Now the problem I face is on a couple of these, like when I poly wire these, I just want an outline. I don't want this and I don't want that and that guy. And it's on a couple others, uh, maybe the R down here, the P, so I needed, I wanted a procedural way to get rid of those lines. So this is how I, uh, I went about it. So basically I unique the points and I do this near point uh, transfer. So uh, all these have become unique uh, lines here. And that's uh, done importantly with the carve, uh, both this checked and then break internal you break points. So that turns them all individual. Now, uh, because these points are looking at these few set, set of points, there is an attribute on these things. Uh, each primitive has the near point, each primitive points have the near point attribute. And these double primitives have the same, like these guys right here, they have the same near point attributes, but you don't know which order they're in. So we need to make a primitive attribute um, basically called a hash. And this is what this thing does. So uh, this uh, formula takes, uh, it, it looks at the primitive, it grabs the smallest point and the largest point, or the lar smallest value and the largest value, it puts them through this formula, and that gives you a unique number. And with those unique numbers, you can basically count them up with the find attribute val count, and then remove them if you have double. So you can see I have these points here, 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 and then they're all removed. And uh, with, uh, you gotta fuse them together and then you have to run a connectivity on them and then delete the points and then connect the points again. And, oh, here is a vertex shift. And that's just so I can alter like where it starts. And then here's the carve. And then as you can see, you know, my text draws uh, properly now. It draws the lines properly and I don't have those crisscross. All right, awesome. This was a quick one, three minutes. I hope to like do these every week. Thanks for watching and feel free to put in requests if you want to learn something in particular or you have a question about this because I know it was really quick, but YouTube tells me you guys don't watch the full thing anyway. So I'm trying to keep this at like three minutes. All right, thanks guys. Have a good week.